Hey everybody, we're back with Amy, and today we're going to talk about the perks of purchasing with an FHA loan. Hey everybody, we're here with Amy again, and today we're going to talk about the perks of purchasing a house with an FHA loan. Well, I think one of the perks is that it's assumable, especially oh, yeah. with rates going up. If you lock in at a low rate today, and three years from now when you go to sell that house and rates are a point to two points higher, you can allow someone to assume your loan so you have a great selling feature. Yeah, a buyer, a, your next buyer would love to hear that. And they assume that lower rate. Yeah. And it's not that you know much money to do an assumption versus a regular loan because assumption costs are about five to six hundred dollars versus three or four thousand. Now, just just to clarify, so that is the remainder of the loan. So let's say they've paid off thirty thousand dollars of the house, mm -hmm. and they're going to sell the house for a little bit more money. Yeah. So they're only getting that lower rate on the remaining. Well, no, no, they have to pay the, the difference as a right. down payment, so you would have to, it's, it's, there's a calculation, so if they have $30,000 worth of equity, then the new buyer would have to meet the new sales price versus what they owe, and that would be their down payment. Gotcha, okay. But they're still assuming that lower rate, so even if you, you know, uh, but typically they won't probably do that unless it's like, you know, just a very minimal equity to assume. Right. Okay. Because if you have that kind of money down, then you're probably going to want to do a conventional loan, regardless of what the rate is, because you know FHA has mortgage insurance. Sure. Yeah. So what are some other perks? Um, I think another perk is it's a low down payment. It's affordable. Rates tend to be very competitive. You could couple it with down payment assist programs. And again, the property standards, you know what you're getting when you purchase a house. It has to meet the standards, which are, you know, not all that bad, sure. but you know, you know, it has to have you know a good roof, and mechanics have to work, and things like well, that. Well, there's one thing that you've been talking about that's really interesting to me, and this is the FHA Reno loan. Mm -hmm. um, that's where you can purchase a house that does need work, that wouldn't necessarily meet FHA standards right now. Perfect. And you will loan yeah. them enough money to do the repairs, but the repairs exactly. do have to be um, qualified, right? You have to have. Well, no, most repairs are qualified through the renovation program, but it's a great way to sell one of those houses that are sitting on the market because sure. it needs a lot of work. And you just go in and you do a feasibility study and you add all the repairs or upgrades that you want to the renovation loan, it becomes one loan. So when you move in the house, there's a certain period of you to do the renovation and the repairs and um, then you have almost like a brand new house. Yeah, that's, that's why it's such a great option for a lot of buyers out there. A lot of first time home buyers, mm -hmm. if they qualify for this, this could be super helpful. So yes, that's definitely a great program. program is really a, a great program. I'm not sure why people don't utilize it even more. Right, maybe we'll talk about that a little bit more in depth soon. Yeah. So, all right. In the coming well, weeks. Yeah, guys, we'll talk to you later. Have a great week. <laughs>